Hello assalamu alaikum today we will learn how to make an elevator system with load detector we will make the simulation so in this simulation we are using this microcontroller arduino uno and this is the motor driver l298 and this is the arduino hx70711 for load cell breakout board this is the module which helps to read the load cell for Arduino. The next component is LCD. This is the 16 into 2 LCD and these are the buttons. We are using these buttons for for the elevator up, down or to stop. And this is the elevator motor which will show is the animation that when the motor is on it will becomes rotating in the clockwise or anti-clockwise for clockwise it goes up and for anti-clockwise it goes down now we will understand how we connect these components with this microcontroller we are using just tag tags to connect these components with our uh, microcontroller arduino so this is the hx711 module we are getting two pins with connecting arduino uno d out and s c k pin and this is the lcd pins we are defining as d4 d5 d6 d7 and uh, we are connecting it through tags because we are using these tags because we want to avoid complexity in the circuit connections we can also connect it uh, from uh, clicking on this this terminal and uh, uh, clicking on this terminal on the four number so this we can also connect it on these things so now we want to avoid the complexity of the circuit connections so that's why we use these tags now we will go to the program what program we uploaded in this microcontroller for the program i will give the my github link in the description you can copy or download the program from there so now we will go to the program file this is my github i have made many projects related to proteus arduino so you can also make these projects now we will want to open the elevator system with load arduino code so click on the elevator system with arduino code code this is the program now we have to copy it click to copy it this is copied now we will go to the arduino ide to run this program for generating a hex file Now this is the program. Now we will understand little bit this program. For this program, we have to these two libraries. One is H HX711. HX711. This is the library. You can download it from clicking on the sketch, then include library, then manage libraries. From manage libraries, you can download hx711 now this is the hx711 library this is the hx711 library you can install from this button i have installed already 7.5 version and then you have to download or install this liquid crystal library then run this simulation this program so we have to generate a hex file for hex file we will go to the file then go to preferences then check the compile option for generating a hex file then we will run now in the outputs the program is uh, done the done it, it is done compiling is done now we have the hex file location and the output section so now we will just copy the this location 
this is the hex file location We require hex file for uploading in the simulation. That's why we want to generate this hex file. Now double click on the Arduino UNO. Now paste it in the program file. Click OK. Now we will run this simulation on the run the simulation button. After running will run after three seconds now it is showing weight measured 0, 0.0 kilogram now this is the weight sensor or uh, load cell we can increase or decrease the load it is uh, already uh, we are programmed it up to 60 kilogram when the weight is 60 kg or more than 60 kg then the elevator will automatically stop it will not work because we in the programming in the program we are we are set it in the program here the weight is higher than 60 kg then this this elevator will become a stop so this is the logics behind this so now we will increase some load now i am putting some load i am putting 25 kilogram of load on the elevator now i have to goes from ground floor to up floor two or three floor now i just press the up button when i press the up button the elevator becomes start that is rotating clockwise it means it is going upward now i have to stop on the floor when i stop uh, when i press the stop button it will become stop now i have to down the elevator now then i will press this down button when I press the down button, the, uh, more, the elevator motor will rotate in the anti-clockwise. It becomes it is going towards down. Means this uh, project or this elevator system will work. If you have any trouble or making this project, if you have any question, then ask me in the comment section. I will be answer your question if you get this video helpful then like it thank you